Hi, welcome back. And today I'm in Stratford upon Avon, the birthplace of Shakespeare. Keep watching as I take you through this historic town. I'm Elena, and this is Elena's UK and Ireland channel. Hit subscribe if you like what you see. One of the things I love about the UK because they utilize the old buildings like that. They can't be all museums, so it's a great idea to rehouse them as shops, banks, cafes, restaurants, and village halls, etc. Yeah, yeah. What a nice morning, actually. Although this house uh, doesn't look like any different to any other house around here <laughs> on this particular street, this is the birthplace of Shakespeare. Huh? Imagine not the whole house, but uh, it's right opposite the Christmas shop. Yeah, stunning, huh? And it's centuries and centuries old. Never see anything like that anywhere else, I guess. So yeah, I think you have to be a Shakespeare fan to come to Stratford Japan even unless you live nearby or something. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let's go see what else this place has to offer. I mean, we're just in phase five of COVID-19, I guess. So um, not a lot of places are open, but pubs and cafes are open now. Uh, today's the 7th of July. So we've only been kind of reopening the last three days in the UK, but it is starting to look good. So public library closed on Sunday. I mean, many other places are open on Sunday, so it might be a bit slightly later opening times, like 11 or 12, but, you know, fear not. A lot of places are open on Sunday in the UK, even now. It's a cute looking coffee shop on the right here, it says coffee number one. The town jewelers. Um, yeah, I feel like boutique shopping, this is the place. There you go, fancy some scones. Cornish bakery. A sausage rolls or anything really. Well, the sun is out and I'm at the river. Ferris wheel. In the river trips, historic lock, they say. Well, yeah, it's a lock, and the river is a bit further, so I spotted on the map. It's fuller. What a place to sit out on a sunny day like this. Um, so we are on our way to Holy Trinity Church to see Shakespeare's grave. Uh, we'll be passing Shakespeare Theatre and a few other places. Hopefully I'll get it all on camera. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so keep watching. Uh, if you've never seen so many swans, you'll see them here. Oh my goodness, I don't think I have so many swans. There's a fun fair on the other side of the river. There's quite a nice river in all fairness. Some Nice barges, gorgeous spot, very open, very green, and um, obviously historic. Also good for shopping, as we discovered. And a quick note, as my f um, videos are not sponsored by anybody, I'm doing them, because I love going and discovering places. And I'll have to show you where I'm going. Not all the time, but most of the time, when I think places worth seeing, 
I'll be sure, you know, I'll be sure to show it to you. It also depends on my time to do the videos, but uh, yeah. Turn left, and you'll have this green space right beside the river of the theater. It's quite nice and peaceful. A few picnic tables. Um, if you fancy just having a sandwich or coffee or relax. Yeah. Nice, huh? <laughs> You'll come to see something like this when you walk to the church. You know what it is? Some sort of an old temple or building, but they utilize it in it. Uh, to put up pictures from the theater. Yeah, if you are here and the theater is open, to go see a play. We want a kind experience. There's another park here, and there's a toilet, public toilet there that is open. So there you go. You know where the toilets are, just in case you need them. Another gorgeous building right opposite the Shakespeare's uh, theater. Because all the theaters are closed now. This one has such a feature, such an old tower. So just here, this place is called Western Square, I think. There's some uh, productions advertised. Looks like there's gonna be Magician's Elephant. Very pretty here. Quite open. Um, yeah, didn't really know what to expect. You never do when you go to places. So, the rooftop restaurant and bar. There you go. Very open. Here we're visiting. Post lockdown. Okay, we're still walking to Holy Trinity Church to see Jesus. Well, the sun is out and I'm in the river. Ferris wheel in the river trips. Historic lock, they say. Well, yeah, it's a lock and the river is a bit further. So I spotted on the map. Beautiful, huh? What a place to sit out on a sunny day like this. Um, so we are on our way to Holy Trinity Church to see Shakespeare's grave. Uh, we'll be passing Shakespeare Theatre and a few other places. Hopefully I'll get it all on camera. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so keep watching. So this is a street with all the restaurants and pubs and it's just off the square where you can hire boats or go on a boat trip. I highly recommend it. If I was here and it wasn't raining and my kids were a bit bigger, um, I would go. Rose and Crown, there's a pub that you should probably visit. There's an old barn that is empty. Hmm. Wonder what it was. Should have... Yeah, quite nice shops and pubs here. So I imagine it's quite a busy place. Um, in a normal circumstances, 